gentlemen, and welcome back to another brand new Animal Graphics tutorial. Today in this tutorial we'll be covering how to create the new Instagram logo in GIMP. Now this tutorial was inspired by obviously the new Instagram logo and I saw a Photoshop tutorial covering this so I thought I'd cover it in a free program which is GIMP. Um, I'll leave a link into the original uh, tutorial from Howard Pinsky over at Iceflow Studios on YouTube. So let's get started. So we're going to start off with a file new, and I just created mine the thumbnail size, which is 1280 by 720. And I'm just going to fill in this background layer with this grey colour, which is 1D, 1D, 1D. I'm then going to create a new layer, which is down here, and it's going to be the same layer. And first of all, I'm going to create the background of this um, icon. So to do this, I'm going to head over to my Rectangle Select tool, and I'm going to hold and cl hold Shift, click and drag whilst holding Shift to create a rounded rectangle. And if you haven't already selected rounded corners, select it currently and hit the radius on 100, so the corners are completely rounded. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to colour it in with this colour, which is E0308F. Head over to my fill tool just here and fill it in. The next thing I'm going to do is create a new layer, and this is going to be the first layer of color. So the first color we have is this orange color. And we're just simply going to select this color and using a large soft brush on around size 800, I'm just going to paint a splodge like so. The next step is to add another new layer, holding the selection still, and we're going to select this color, FED374, and we're going to create a smaller splodge like so, and that's the next color. The next color is a blue color, and that can be found here. The color is 4865D3, and for this one, we start at the top here, and just click, like so. That's all the colors done. To deselect our selection, we wanna hit Control, Shift, A, and I'm just going to Create the group. With all these inside. Making sure that they are in order. I'm just going to lock all of these elements together so when we move it into the center, it'll all be aligned nicely. The next thing I'm going to do is we're going to create the actual uh, camera like logo style. To do this, select the rectangle select tool again and start in the uppermost corner, bringing a new layer just above the icon background. Holding shift to scale accordingly. I'm then going to fill this layer with a white I'm then going to go to my select option, hit select shrink and shrink it by 40. I'm then going to hit command X on my keyboard then command shift A to deselect. Using the uh, the cursor tool, I'm going to center it to our image. 
going to create a new layer once again to create the circle inside. To do this, just head over to the ellipse select tool, holding shift and dragging to create an ellipse. Fill it again with white. Hit select, shrink, shrink this one by 30. Command shift A or control shift A depending on what operating system. And that's looking nice. Create one more layer. This is going to be the small icon here. And we're just going to fill this with white. And there we have it. I'm just going to add a quick drop shadow by going over to my la uh, bottom layer here, selecting layer, sorry, selecting filters, light and shadow, drop shadow. And this is a script flu script foo plugin. So you can download this at uh, typing GIMP script foo. And I have previous tutorials on how to install that. And there we go. And that is how to create the new Instagram logo within GIMP. Thank you very much for watching this tutorial. And I shall catch you in my next video tutorial.